Done. Hey, Roxy, uh, could you come through for a moment? Eh. What is it, Terrence? I'm finally done decorating. Uh, what do you think of it? Oh, it looks great. Oh, thank you, Rox. <sighs> oh, come on. Huh? What was that? I have no idea. And to be very honest, I don't know if I want to know. I'm gonna go and check it out. Wait, Roxy! And he's gone. <sighs> On Christmas, seriously? Roxy, wait! What? Roxy, I think we need to think about this. Come up with some sort of plan. Terrence, I doubt it's gonna be anything too bad. Roxy, recently a lot of weird things have been happening, so I think it would be best if we come up with a plan. Oh, come on, Terrence, it's like in those movies. You always walk to the creepy sound. What film have you ever watched where that is a good idea? Many films. So I'm just going to go into the room and see if there's anything bad. Wait, Roxy! See, Terrence? Nothing! <laughs> Roxy! Roxy! Ugh! Ugh. Ugh. Uh, who are you? Uh, uh, what? Where am I? Am I dead? Wait, what's going on? Terrence? You're finally awake. Uh, Roxy, what's going on? Well, Terrence, you see, obviously we've been tied up. And we're going to be sacrificed to some sort of, like, death guard. What? Thank you for giving him the basic rundown. You're welcome. Roxy. What? Whatever. Anyway, who are you? And why is it snowing? You can call me the follower. And to be very honest, I have no clue why it's snowing indoors. It just kind of happens around me. What? Oh, who do you follow? I follow... The Harbinger. Oh, how specific. Who's the Harbinger, and why are you doing this exactly? The Harbinger is our great leader. And by sacrificing you, we shall finally be able to open the Liminal. Now, you might be wondering what the Liminal is. Well, the Liminal is a place in between where we come from. Well, not you. Where me and the Harbinger and the others come from, but you get what I mean. Hey, Roxy. Shh. What? We need to get out of here now. Um, well, that might be a little bit difficult if you haven't realized, like, we're tied up. Well, wait. It's just tinsel. We can easily just break out of it. Oh. Yeah, we are just tied up in tinsel. Okay, on the count of three. One, two, three. But that does not matter. All that matters is that Lord Death shall- Oh, come on, I did it again, didn't I? I went on a wild monologue, giving them enough time to escape. Ugh! Eh! Eh! Ugh, come on! Ah! I'm out! Ugh, finally! Roxy, come on! Ah, uh, come on. Oh no. Terrence, get out of the way! <laughs> what? What? Oh god! Uh. Uh. Okay. Let's get this over with. No, no, no. Terrence! <clears throat> Wait, what? <laughs> no, 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 get off of me! No! Terrence! <laughs> Uh. Roxy? 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 Ro Roxy? Roxy, get up. No. Ah. Oh. Oh. Oh, that tickled a bit. Roxy? Is that you? Uh, are you okay? Yep, I'm completely fine. Why wouldn't I be? Well, you got hit by lightning for one. Ah, well, it's not my first time. Okay. Wait, what? Well, you see... Ah! Well, you see... I am going to kill you. Oh, no. 
Did your voice just change? Nine. It, it has. But that's not possible. Doesn't matter. I will kill you. Ow. Wait, what? Huh? <laughs> Gerald? Wait, you saved us? <laughs> no. I'm not here to save you. I'm here to kill you. Ah, uh, don't you love it, audience, when a Christmas special has nothing to do with Christmas? It's fun. Are we expecting something more? Nah, nah, nothing's happening. Cut camera.